And so mm-hmm. ideally what you do is get, get the hogs basically acclimated to all coming to your placebo bait, to the bait that doesn't have the toxin in it, but is made of the same uh, other materials otherwise. And then once they're used to consuming it, then you do a switch out uh, on it and put the toxic bait in. And uh, that's the theory at least. But that's, you know, that's what we're going to learn um, from this next phase. You know, a lot, most of the stuff that we've done, we've either done in, in our pens or in our 300-acre exclosure at the Kerr area. Mm-hmm. Uh, so this is going to go to the field. USDA will be radio collaring uh, feral hogs. Uh, we will be radio collaring raccoons in conjunction with this. Uh, we'll have, you know, cameras out. So we'll be monitoring, you know, how this, you know, how the, the, the hogs and other animals react to the feeders out there you know, in a natural environment the way we would anticipate deploying this, um, you know, if it was registered.